guys, my name is Ace Wolfie and welcome back to another Minecraft Pocket Edition video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a nuclear missile with common blocks. And uh, today I'm joined with my friend Fire Wolfie. He's going to be the test subject for today's video. Uh, and yeah, but before we start this video guys, I would like you guys to smash that like button for me and also make sure to click that subscribe button. So you guys can join my community channel and so make sure to turn on that notification bell so you guys won't miss any of my videos again. So yeah, so first of all guys, uh, let's, uh, I'm going to show you guys how this machine works. So first of all, let's uh, get the coordinate for the target. So let's do this and copy this. So this is the uh, comment for the target. So, and after you place the target, what you want to do is to craft the missile. And to do that, just drop one block of iron and also one gunpowder. And it will turn into a spawn egg. So this spawn egg is actually a missile. So if you place it, you will place a missile. And to activate it, just burn under it and it will fly to the point where you place the target. So you can place it anywhere you want. You can place it on top of your friend house or anywhere. It's all, it's all up to you. And also, for example, you forgot to, to place a target and you just flew the missile away without any target. And to, to, to uh, use it again, what you want to do is to reset the common block, uh, all of the system by pressing this button. So first let's put the missile, this doesn't work. So to do that, to make it work, what you want to do is to press this reset button press that and now it works and you can do it again so let's copy this activate the missile uh, oh yeah it's really cool and it will drop to the point where you place the target again so yeah so that's how the machine works now I'm gonna show you guys how you can have this machine into your own world so yeah let's go so first of all what you will guys want to do is to prepare for the material so what you need to build this creation are this and also obviously a common block so if you guys didn't know how to get common block go to the chat box and type in slash give at p command underscore uh, command underscore block and yeah you, you'll get one and i have two now and let's get rid of one of it and after that build a platform so place this like a seven any type of block like that and or to this side and fill, fill it up. Now after that what you want to do is to break this block like right over here the corner and place common block right there and also a, a button. Place a button right here so let's take the button and place it here. So after that what you want to do is to place another common block on top of this one so make sure to sneak for that and after that place another tree common block so it is four common blocks and uh, also here and this one are facing upward so make sure that uh, the arrow for this four common blocks are facing that way okay and for this two common blocks are facing upward okay it's really important so if you guys didn't do it right it will not work okay so and after that what you want to do to place another four common blocks on top of this one so all the arrows facing that way same as the bottom one and after that place another common block right here with redstone comparator so make sure to sneak for that over here and after that another common block like in front of the redstone comparator so like so and make sure all the arrow again it's really important all the arrow are facing that way okay it's very important guys uh, don't uh, don't mess it up and also over here I uh, like uh, five common blocks so like so and all the arrow again are facing uh, the same way and after that break this block so now what you guys want to do is to change all the block type and all of those kind of stuff and so yeah for this one it's just normal and this one let's change this to repeat and always active okay this, uh, let's do this one first this one chain conditional and always active and this one chain conditional and always active and the same as this one chain conditional and always active and this one the same as all uh, all this four the same as the bottom one this chain conditional and always active and this one too 
also for this one and for this one it's repeat and always active and also chain conditional and always active after that is repeat always active and for this one just let it be like what it is so it is impulse and this one repeat and always active and for this one chain conditional and always active and for this one it is repeat and always active and and for this one it is chain but just let the condition unconditional okay so as you guys can see if the unconditional one it has a straight line behind it not like the, the other one the other one the conditional one it is not straight so you can compare it which one is which uh, which one is which okay so this one chain conditional and always active and for this one repeat and always active and that's it so what you guys want to do now is to go into this description and uh, check out the link that I have put in there. So it is the comment block link and you guys can copy paste it and put it for example for this one number one. Put it there and two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen and twenty. So yeah, copy pasted it and after you copy pasted all of the comments that I have put in the description Now you have to place it like for example this one, this one, this is the number one comments And you have to place it inside of the number one comment, comment blocks And same goes uh, to number two and three, four and all the way, okay? So what you want to do now, what I mean by bottom chest coordinate is uh, the place where the chest is going to be later, okay? The bottom one. So it is, let's delete this first. So it is this one. The chest will be right here later. And let's get the coordinate. So it is uh, top left corner, 17, 5 and minus 6. Let's put that in. Uh, what is it? Uh, no, no, this one. Uh, this one. Yeah. So set blocks, 17, 5 and minus 6. So yeah, it's right. And after that, let's go to the next one. And so it is this, this one. And it is actually the same one. So this one, bottom chest coordinate. So let's put the same coordinate into this common blocks. So it is 17, 5 and minus 6. And oh yeah, air, 0 and destroy. And I forgot about this one, so let's put that in. Uh, air zero and destroy. And yeah, let's continue. And now for this command, it said like one block under redstone comparator, right? So yeah, you guys have to get the coordinate for that. So under the redstone comparator, so it is this one, so this place. So this. Um, so uh, let's just uh, break it. Um, yeah, break this and also this and stay inside here and get the coordinate. So it is 16, 6 and minus 5. 16, 6 and minus 5, and minus 5. so it is um, 16, 6 and minus 5, so yeah it's right, and after that let's put this um, common blocks back, and chain conditional and always active, and for this one it is the set block, so it is set block, and the coordinate uh, for the chest, so it is what, 17 and 5 and minus 6. Does, uh, let's check it up first. Yes, right. And after that, also, oh yeah, the resin comparator. And yeah, that's it. So let's continue. So 
So it is 16, 6, and minus 5. Yeah. So yeah, now this part of common blocks is done. Now let's go, uh, let's close this thing first. Um, and now let's go into this, this side. So yeah, let's go into it. Now for this part, let's build the common block. Um, so what you're gonna do is to get common block and place it right here. And all the arrows are facing the same way. And let's destroy this. Let's, place common block here and here here and jump and all the arrow are facing that way okay all the arrow all the common blocks arrow that will be here and chest right here and another common block and jump right here and also here here and yeah and that's all and now let's change the block type and now for the block type let's change everything and also I already put a number for all the common blocks for later so let's change this one to wait no this one is actually change unconditional and always active so all uh, the common blocks in, in this part all is um, unconditional okay and this one chain and always active And always active so yeah that's all now let's go into the comments so now for the comments what you're gonna do is the same thing as the first part so um, it, the, it has number in it like for this one 21 so you guys have to go to into the description and copy the number 21 and put it in inside of the common book uh, uh, it's the same number with the same number like this one And now for this one, so it is coordinate one block under redstone uh, comparator. So it is the coordinate that you have checked in before. So let's check it out again. So it was um, this coordinate under the redstone comparator. So you have to get the, those coordinates and put it in. So it is uh, 16, 5 and minus um, 6, uh, no, 5, yeah, 5. Then Copy now, as you guys can see, it will clone this chest right here. Oh, yeah, and also by the way, I forgot something. Uh, first, you guys have to name the nameplate. 
so let's take uh, our name tag an empty name tag so two name tag and put our anvil down and let's name this name tag so for this one just put it a okay it's a and the other one um nuke nuke yeah and yeah that's it now let's um oh yeah and also i forgot uh we have to get uh a silver fish spawn egg so let's get silver fish spawn egg where is it silver fish no skull oh silver fish so let's take this only one silver fish spawn egg then after the anvil and name this to missile so with capital M and missile Let's break this common block first. Uh, break this and place the missile or silverfish into this common block, and it will copy under it. As you guys can see, if I break it, it will drop the um, the spawn egg. Uh, so now, what you got, what got gonna do is to grab yourself the common block again and place it right here. And now, let's place our last so it is repeat and always active so it is this one and yeah it's done and what you guys want to do now is to um, make your missile um, as you like you can make it anything any look you want like for example like the first one like in the intro I'll show you guys with the creeper but you have to name the creeper A with the anvil so yeah let's make the missile so the missile will look something like this now but first let's name the missile or all a except the last one so this one a a this one this one and for this one nuke so everyone will teleport to the nuke one so yeah and then after that if you want you can block it off with glass or or maybe you can put sign in it or anything it's all your creation but first let's delete this one and because we don't want uh, to use the old one we want to use our new one that we make now so let's delete that as you guys can see we're not gonna use that one we're gonna use the one that we just made now so now grab yourself the block of iron and also the gunpowder drop it Let's see if it is work. If it works, and it works. Yeah, it's really cool. And to use this, same as the first, uh, as I sh uh, show you in the intro. So first, let's put the target. So let's start in summon a silver fish, or maybe anything you want, like for example chicken. But then I'm gonna use silver fish and target with capital T and three this. And what the heck? The silver fish isn't invisible. I think I don't, I've done something wrong. Wait, guys. And oh my god, guys, I'm so stupid. Look at this. I'm using three tildes with the effect. That's so dumb. I'm sorry about that. But anyways, I'm gonna change it. Um, what you guys what got gonna see later in the. Uh, description it's gonna be the right one okay so don't be worried about it so yeah I've changed everything so now the silver fish is invisible and now let's place uh, the missile so and also let's get ourselves a film and still and burn uh, burn it and boom it works oh my god guys I'm really sorry but sometimes um, Minecraft is really buggy common block like sometimes it doesn't work but if it is doesn't doesn't work try to um, reset everything maybe reset your world or maybe try to find um, the, some comments part that doesn't work so you guys have to break it and redo it again but I'm real sorry I, I can't fix this that it's already Minecraft <laughs> sometimes it's really buggy so yeah.
So yeah guys that's it for today I hope you guys did enjoy this video and if you did make sure to smash that like button and also I, I'll, I will promise you guys if you guys did everything correctly if you follow my instruction and do everything right nothing will be wrong nothing will be buggy and yeah hopefully you got it and good luck that's it for me peace out guys